That's the effects the amount of damage you do with spells and the amount of damage you take from spells and elemental attacks from bad guys. How beat how beefy you is. There that's a crazy looking horse. Oh Nelly! This this horse the horse has gone snake crazy. Maybe it's another crazy Hey there boy. Hey fella, I'm a friend, okay? It's cool, alright? Be cool, don't freak out on me. Look him in the eyes. You can call look at the horse line. One of them is fixed in a glassy thousand yard stare. The other one is revolving madly in its socket like he's thinking of trying to escape in every direction simultaneously. He looks to be calming down a little. Now that's clear, you aren't actually made of spiders, though. So. He twitches a bit, okay, a lot, but he's dragging us that you aren't going to eat his eyes or suck out his soul or whatever, man. <laughs> that's a good boy. <laughs> Snurf. You feed the crazy horse some of the homing oats and it gallops away with a winning, or rather, a win or oracle. How hopefully he's headed home and not into the twelfth dimension. <laughs> oh, this game is it's pretty funny. Okay, I think it. What's it? You don't have. What? Oh, I think it said something probably about me not having to walk all the way because I can just warp around. Too far to go on foot. You need a horse. I do need a horse. Uh, let's go see uh, this dude first, cause I've got. I found these mugs. Oh, how'd you know my last name? Oh, cause of the gravestones. I saw the graves in the cemetery. Sorry for your loss. I saw it happen. The bar said it was cows. He used to ranch cattle back before, well, before they came home. Paul didn't make it, but Ma and I managed to rebuild. We ranched pigs instead, and she left me a place when she passed. It used to be a cow ranch, and they attacked a couple of days ago. It happened so fast, they didn't have time to get my rifle out. Out of the gun safe. Cow smashed in the front door, and a fire shot back by the roof cellar. House went blazes. She drains a glass. I ain't want to talk about it anymore. What will you do now? Head west. I can't leave without my rifle, though. It was Maul's rifle. That's all I got left. Of... Where is it? I need someone to go get it for me. Yeah, I'll go get it. I'll go get it for you, baby. Baby. All right, so what's... Uh... Oh, he's asleep. Looks like they're playing for spiders now. That's a right shiny rock you got. I'll give you a seven meat for that rock. Uh, uh, sure. You, you'll stay out of Orhol if you know what's good for you. Stuff, there's stuff down on the 40th level that ain't worth messing with. Is that? Is there any reason to not sell? Let's change on the side of the rock. Okay. Gross. Alright, give him his door back. Four hundred meat. Well, the frickers busted the lock on their book door. I gotta need to get a new lock. Okay. Face deep. Bimmy. So which one was Bimmy? What do you want to trade? I seriously doubt that his name is Bray. Okay, so I guess nothing. Oh, God, oh, why are there so many mugs? And what's the point of jumping? Did something happen later? Okay. So much meat. Oh, I can... Okay. About to level up. Yay. Dead Eye level 2. Hell yeah. You know, might as well if I'm getting... You're not allowed in Topeka anymore, remember? If I'm getting free XP, might as well, right? 
Okay. Sorry, it's a tad chilly here. Okay, so we've got you behold a pale horse, like absurdly pale. See the madness that dances on the other side of the void. No, that's the normal one. We look directly at her. Thanks for sending back my dark horse. It's not a pale horse, may it say. He was eating local weed again, wasn't he? Here's a little extra for you. Can you sell me a horse? Oh, so I guess he probably gave me exactly a thousand meat. About the injury? But she gave up, but she gave up doctoring. Said she didn't talk to anyone except Nurse Whiskey. Is that an actual nurse or pretty sure she was just being sarcastic? Okay, well, I need a horse. Shifty looking dark one. I'll go with the spooky pill and give you the one with the crazy eyes. Crazy eyes cracks me up, so is something wrong with him? <laughs> no, not such. He's perfectly functional. But, well, he's always sticking off the thousand things called chew on locally that grows there. And that makes him see. Color me intrigued. Give him a name. Tim? No. Uh, yeah, you know what? Tim's fine. That's what the name should name your horse Tim. Uh, no, we're gonna name it. Uh, <laughs> I'm gonna name it like Brader the Trader. Oh, how about uh, Bradlin? No, you know, we're going to put a Y in there because that looks Bradlin. Okay, yes. It has a nice ring to it. Southeast West map. Free with every horse purchase is a complimentary map. All right, Bradlin out of town. Uh, not yet. We're going to go check out. What brand? Nurse Whiskey. Your favorite, I'm led to believe. Didn't know she makes house calls. All right, hold on. I'm gonna take you that whiskey, you promise me. Whiskey, stat. She puts the flask back in her pocket and starts chugging out of the bottle. Who's the doctor here, me or you? Okay, point taken. Preen a little bit. Sure, you want to. Not that they're gonna do you much good in this doomed, forsaken hellhole. Just try being less cheerful, Doc. Leave through the legend of Curly's Meat, the life and works of Fred Ferguson, and the galvanoid tongues of Primer. You make like a tree and leaf. Uh, is that. Oh, gumption. Level of get up and get her done. The higher it is, the quicker you are. Speed, maximum peace, clean capacity. Okay, these are. The book tells the story of a legendary treasure, a massive chest full of premium meat secreted in the hidden sense, not in the extruded sense, in the western desert by an old cow hand named Curly Butterfield. This book for its specific source. You mostly just find a list of reasons that drinking alcohol is bad. So it, it's actually a work of ludicrous speculative fiction. Ha ha. At least there are some useful appendices in the back and some diagrams of appendices. Oh, got for a goblin song. I wonder if maybe I could have talked, spoken to the goblin in the beginning. The stove is spotless. Uh, yeah, why is there so much TNT right next to that fireplace? Like, uh, god dang. Uh, is every teach poor whiskey down her neck, occasionally stopping to breathe? Uh, is everything all right? Depends how fast I get this week, even though my bloodstream compared to how fast my liver filters it out. I can't talk at the drink. Can't talk and drink at the same time, so. Dead men walking? Courts. Oh, yeah, there's skeletons in the cemetery. It's nice to get some outside confirmation I'm not losing my damn mind. Patience, so oh, ouch. Oh, um, um, indeed. She turns away from you and focuses her attention back on the bottle. Hmm. The idea. Of what now? It's when you get in a rumor. What is it? It's when you get incomplete information from an unverified source. 
a necromancer cost. So I was always sending magic out to the world somehow. Magic like the bean slingers use. That'd be one hell of a can of beans. That would be a hell of a can of beans. Let's deal with the TNT. Fair enough. I mean, not the necromancer. Well, maybe someone ought to try and stop them. You, because I know you ain't talking about me. Well, why not you? You aren't that old. You're the old, and if I were going to pick someone to go up against Necromancer, I'd, it'd be someone who knows about death, but in a scientific way. A doctor, right? And it sounds to me like you've got plenty of motivation to get the job done for your friends and everyone. It beats doing nothing, anyway. You seriously expect me to ride out west by myself chasing rumor? Doesn't have to be. Oh, I don't have to get a party member? In regards to your thought place, far. Alright, kid, what the hell? Let's give it a shot. Cool. Huh. Did I just get. Did, maybe not. Dang. I was kind of hoping. Okay. Okay. Well, maybe then, uh. Uh. I think there's a second floor and there's a door up there. Oh yeah, maybe if I could have spoken to that. Yeah, I'm finished business you got. Well, forever man, finish sure you're ready to leave. On second thought, yeah, let's not do that just yet. Uh, the Cochran Ranch. New, new. All right. Well, let's do it then. Oh, water drop has pulled away. Oh, is this what's remaining of the house? Uh, was that a? through it anyway. There's a mill fixing a knife. Grab it. Varmint skin and knife. Okay. These paths were not safe. What the fuck is that? This thing looks angry. You're not going to make it sad say without dealing with it. Deal with it. A pyro bow. Hot resistance 50. Um, okay. I'm just gonna shoot it. Oh, is it supposed to be like a bean sling here? Okay, I'm gonna. Uh, I like the Gordon free, free, free minute. I'd rather just kill it dead. Gumption level 2. Awesome. Alright, so now we got Susie's rifle. I was kind of hoping that would make that noise quick because that sounds really fucking creepy. Okay, so now we got Susie's rifle. Where are you at? Susie's rifle. There's six little notches carved into the stock. What do I? Yep, here she is. I'm Bobcat. Can't rifle say what this means. If you want me to tag along when you head west, just say the word. Sounds good. Okay, so, uh, do I have a way of looking at, like, quests? Gear. Bag of Holy Ghost. I don't really... Allows you to collect skins from beasts after combat. Combats. Sorry. Fall them out to dirt water. Like, I can't think of... I can't do that anymore. I mean, there's nothing else for me to do here, so I might as well. Uh... Oh, wait, can I? Um, can... Like, what happens if I. You know, I want to ride a horse. If I want to do anything, yes. Yep. You take Crazy Pete. <laughs> That's 
Finish your trade. Somebody can rely on for emotional and combat support. Who will you take with you? Doc Alice, Susie Cochran. Not recommended. Take thought. Don't leave yet. Uh, we'll take Susie. I've been all max spending your experience points for you. I'm, I'm happy to keep doing it, although and I promise to give you a nice, well-rounded experience. Should I keep it up, or do you prefer to decide for yourself where your XP gets spent? Uh, you know, we'll just do automatically because I'm not really caring that much. Uh, Manifest Destiny Rail Camp. We'll go to Dirtwater. Is that, is that her? It's your partner. How the bad the cows, cow attacks are getting. Stern's Ranch, not far from here. Where do you think we'll go? I got a train's way to go. Didn't that map the Hosser gave it have marked some railroad camp? Good idea. Uh, you know what? Uh, what other. Thanks for real. He makes a sort of glurk noise. Email. Room for rent, inquire within. Probably for a shit ton of meat or something. Dirt water mercantile. What you got? Uh, such a provender, provender sort of. Various groceries. That's my stuff. For sale disposable binoculars. So. Want to want to look at more than one thing through them? Too bad. Uh, yeah, we'll buy that because why not? Increase speed by one. Oh, it's for the rest of the day. Shovels a thousand. Why? Modern snake oiler uses to learn a new snake oiling skill. Uh, sure. Okay, what? Uh, you can find a high vantage point. Okay. Read it. There's an article. There's a recipe for a quick brew potion that fortifies your body, mind, and spirit. Strong medicine. There's an article. Use bad medicine combat that will reduce the target's moxie. There's a recipe for a new cannibal concoction that looks like a skill that lets you recover HP in combat. Hmm. Cover HP in combat. That could be good, I guess. So we'll do that. Here's somebody stolen your magazine. Okay. Sponsored by LTNT. I like an email for me. Mm, nope. Darn. Nope. Okay. Fifty me first. We'll go selling flowers. Sweet smell of flowers. Thanks again, Master. Hey, are you the sheriff right here? No, we don't currently have a sheriff. Offer to help. One of the posters are back there. The cells are over yonder. It's a wanted poster. No way you misread it. It's a wasted poster? Close enough. Stripey hat gang. Grand theft paint. And taste them have available. Yes. It's a wanted poster, or a wanted poster, if accuracy is important. House in the Desert Gang for mortgage non payment. Uh, yeah, we'll take them. Sure. Empty cell, empty cell, empty cell, and empty cell. This cell is all ghostly. Why is that ghostly? Okay. Okay. I guess I should go see about renting this room. Uh, why? What is wrong with you? Why are you so pissed? Lot available. Maybe can I build something there? Make a lot. Lot available. Make a lot. Not a lot available past this point. Okay. You are way too happy with your... I don't know what it is you've got. Alright. Jewel Saloon. Can I spit? 
The Jewel Saloon is pretty nice and saloons co action glass and windows, more than two kinds of drinks, poker room, instead of a coffee pint pit. But this is spittoon, it's still a spittoon. <laughs> is it fancies? Inspect it. You're <laughs> alright, fine, you're now hunkered next to a brass filled bucket. Search it. You have to put your hand in a bucket of something of the color and viscosity of maple syrup, except instead of maple it's flavored with the inside of the mouths of people who chew cigars. Glort. Keep searching. Filthy porcelain cow. What do you be? <laughs> Quote, poker room. Anyway, right, you all. Hell player's not good at his job. Slop five meat. Kitchen. Keep bartender for stage. Is there a point? Anything in the kitchen? Slop helper. I was just, you know, looking around. So you're the nose type, eh? Well, for adventuresome, as it happens, there's something you can do for me. I'm out of salt peter and I need someone to go pick up some more. Salt peter? And they used to make gunpowder and <laughs> You bet it, your best bet some mil your best bets a military camp. Shut up. There's one that's court fort cowardice to keep in a little green jar. Cool. What else we got over here? Nothing. Nothing. Alright, you know, whatever. You know. It's in the poker room. Rules. Three fours of diamonds and four sixes of clubs counts as a straight. Any player passing out during the table must remove their boots. Twos are wild unless accompanied by three. Deuces are wild unless accompanied by three eights. One arm queens are wild unless accompanied by a deuce of diamonds. Okay, that's enough of that right now. Antia. A tray. First round of the pause 16, you estimate your chance of winning is at around 30%. Just gonna check it. Bin raises. I'm terrible at poker, let me just say. No room at that table. That table's full up. Why are they all pulling out their guns? It's your partner. I know you to call me Lloyd. What can I do for you? Well, if you're here with the candle store, there's some there's something's gone wrong with our player, piano player. Yeah, it's something like that. I'll see what I can do. All the starts got broken months ago. That's disappointing. You said old man by the piano. Old Ellsbury. Tra tragic failures. Brian and Poet come with. Had to get no work to make ends meet. Did catch well. <laughs> he what now? Did passing well as a prospector until one day he lost his mind in a mind. He saw something. Some of the men stopped telling his weird stories. Seems calm down, and as long as he doesn't make any trouble, I don't mind him too much. I feel a little sorry for him, to be honest. Poor fellow. Uh, play a room for your partner, too. You interested? He said was a banker fellow, and he paid a month in advance right before game, so I've killed my bandits. He seemed like a decent source. The room's yours if you want it. Uh, yeah. We shall take. I'll take some bourbon. Dirt water bourbon. Increase your max HP by five for the rest of the day. Okay, let's go check out this piano player again. The other piano, the player piano player's coach reeled the hatch on his back leads to his innards. It's locked, but it's not a very good lock. Pick the lock. Check out the machinery inside. There's always some wrong going on the plinking and 
Okay, so I don't have enough mysticality to be able to tell what's wrong with it. Alright, partner. Yeah. Check out the guest room. Okay, she's up here. This is Susie's bed. Insult yourself. Angry. Oh. Snake pit mine. Blank postcard. You dream that you're having lunch with your mother in a canoe, but then you meet someone who looks exactly like a sword but isn't. You wake up drenched in sweat. Well, okay then. And hungry and sober. 